I'm Chica. I'm rich, I'm beautiful, and I achieve my goals and turn my dreams into reality. I'm deserving of success and all the wonderful things life has to offer. And as for men, you have to be perfect to deserve me. I turned down all the men that came my way because I felt they were not perfect enough. That, by the way, is a decision I regret. Fast forward to five years later, I'm here, single and lonely. A look! Oh. He proposed! <laughs> oh, do, yes! Does he propose? He did! He did! Babes, I told you! I told you, right? This bouquet thing works! I mean, do you think it's a coincidence that does he propose after two two years? Look! I'm getting married! And <laughs> I'm so happy! I just I need to call! I just I'm getting married, babes! I need to call everybody! My <sighs> I'll, 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 I'll talk to you. Okay. You know, I'm just so happy. <laughs> and that was how I resorted to attending weddings and catching bouquets. I became a pro at catching bouquets. Broke my leg a few times. I was getting tired. And frustrated. Does this catching of bouquet really work? Hello, madam. How was the wedding? Daniel, I've told you to stop calling me madam. It makes me feel old. And the wedding was just like any other wedding. Let's go. Does this catching bouquet thing even work? Well, I believe that whatever you believe works for you, madam. Daniel, if you call me madam one more time, you will lose your salary. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Chica. But yeah, I truly believe that whatever works for you is what you believe in. 
But I believe it. I saw it happen for Judith. Well, maybe your love story isn't meant to bloom that way. Maybe you are meant for something different and maybe your love story is just around the corner. Well, I hope it comes soon. And especially because it's Valentine's. I don't like surprises. Music. Daniel, um, can you stop by the nearest restaurant? I'm very hungry. Why are you hungry? You didn't eat at the wedding. I needed all the strength to catch this bouquet. Okay. Got you. Uh, hold on, let me get that. Everyone is getting hooked but me. Should I just propose to this one? Chica, it's not that bad. People will say desperation pushed me to marrying my driver. I'll have this and then you can just ask him what he's having. Uh, you know what, I'll just have whatever she's having. Whatever she's having is cool. Thank you. Well, thank you for inviting me to eat. It's nothing. I just thought you'd be hungry as well. Thanks. If you don't mind, I'd like to pay for this one. The food. <laughs> How much am I paying you? How much is your salary? I, uh, I've been saving my salary. Please, Daniel, don't embarrass us. I it's fine. I promise. I'm not going to embarrass us. I just want to pay. Okay. All right, this is the person. Okay. Uh-uh. 65k for what now? How much is bag of rice now? Um, it's fine. No, I'll no, just... no. I was still paid. The bill is very expensive, that's all. It was so expensive. What's that? Oh, wow. Well, you guys are very expensive. Oh, Daniel. Uh, here, savings. I'm paying. <laughs> if it doesn't work, it's fine. I have it's to going work. to work. Okay. Uh... If it doesn't work, it's fine. I, I have my card here. Okay, yeah. You're right. Okay. All right, thanks. All right, thank you, sir. We we thank God, right? All right. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. What's this? This is so boring. Wow, not for me. Yes. Yes, it's more like it. Yes. Hi, babe. <laughs> How are you now? What's up? <sighs> babe, come. Come and check out this wedding theme. Like, I literally just saw it now. See, check it out. It's nice, right? Babe, I'm so sorry. Please, 
can I check it out later? I'm so tired. Sorry. <sighs> you know, if I didn't know you too well, I would have said you're clearly not happy for me. Babe, uh -huh. don't, don't say that. You know I love you. It's just my head is banging. Please, can I check it out later? Oh, okay. Sure. Um, you need to get it checked out, okay? Rest or something, yeah. I do. I'll just... I'll go upstairs. Yeah. <sighs> Welcome. Thank you. It's okay. Yeah. <sighs> yep. Yes. Love it. Love it. Love it. Mm. <sighs> mm. Did someone lay a curse on me? Why am I the only one single among my friends? Am I not beautiful? Or should I just go back to Femi? Hello, who is this? Hi, Femi. It's Chica. I wanted us to talk. Talk about what? Us. I wanted to see if we could we could pick things up from from where we left it. <laughs> uh, okay. You, you mean investors are coming from Tokyo this weekend? Uh, uh, we can meet at the hotel, okay? Wait, investor. Wait, hotel. Tell them you are a married man with a pregnant wife. Baby, I don't like this. You're embarrassing me. I'm talking to a colleague. I will keep embarrassing you till you learn to use some zipper. Femi, are you not tired of cheating? Are you not? Baby, you're just a colleague. You're embarrassing me. I'm not cheating on you. I love you so much. So why you have not cheated on me these five years of marriage? Baby, I have never cheated on you. Drop this trust issue, okay? You need to trust me. I trust what? Let me keep your zipper. I will trust you to cheat. <sighs> Femi is married. Can I call? Can I call? Sam. I can call Sam. His number is not going through. Lawrence. I can call Lawrence. Just, just keep driving. No, 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 I'm not gonna keep driving when you're like this. Hey. Chica, you know that you can talk to me, right? I 
house and check on whatever it is. Please don't cry. I can't bear to see you cry, please. That breaks my heart. I hate to see you cry. Chica, you know that you can talk to me, right? <laughs> Listen, Chica, whatever it is, please don't cry. I can't bear to see you cry, please. That breaks my heart. I hate to see you cry. I can't bear to see you cry, please. That breaks my heart. I hate to see you cry. Must be a spiritual attack. Paula, my secretary, is getting married next weekend. Femi is already married. And Cynthia's wedding is next month. How did Femi get into the conversation? She went to see him again. Femi is not that bad. He's not. What is wrong with you? This guy hates you. Are you that desperate? Everyone around me is getting hooked, except for me. Is it so hard to find someone as sweet as Daniel? Uh, as sweet as Daniel? 
<laughs> oh, that's that's not what I meant. Obviously, I can't be caught dead with Daniel. He's my driver. <sighs> okay. Well. <laughs> but seriously, I think I need to go to a prayer house. <clears throat> okay. You know what? There is this really cool dating site that I stumbled upon. Okay? I think you should give it a shot. Dating site? Mm-hmm. Am I that desperate? Uh-huh. And you want to go to a prayer house? Yeah. Because I need to use the spiritual mm. to control the physical. Yeah. Spirituality. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. Her husband now. Carry me to go. You hey. never carry me to go. My husband now. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. Her husband now. Carry me to go. You never carry me to go. My husband now. You say carry me to go. Her husband Husband man, locate her now! Amen! You can feel it. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Mm. I say, the tall man, handsome, a rich man, rejoice. Mm. I command every husband man that is eligible to locate her now in Jesus' name! Amen! Amen! Oh. This year is your year. Amen. This bar is your bar. Amen. <laughs> In 30 days, 30 days prayer and fasting is what you need. Okay, prophet. In 30 days. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Your husband will locate you. Amen. I say your husband man will locate you. Amen. Stand up. Begin to dance. Begin to dance. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. My husband. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. My husband. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. Her husband now. Carry me to go. I say carry her to go. My husband. Carry her to go. I say carry her to go. Her husband. Hey. I say carry her to go. Her husband house. What's it, dear? Yes, yes, that's a good daughter. <laughs> You're eating yam and egg. Is it spicy? Did you season it well? Mm -hmm. Very spicy. I like it. Mm. 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 You added plenty of pepper. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, I did. Plenty of pepper. I yeah. can see. Pepper. Yeah. Can you taste the ginger? Ginger. Okay, what of the turmeric? No, just eat. Why don't you just eat? No, I don't want to eat. You know I can't eat. I'm fasting. You're fasting? Yeah. Are you sure you've been fasting all this while? Because all these questions you're asking me only means one thing. Well, I was 
wondering what you were doing on Valentine's Day. If you have no plans, I can take you someplace nice. Y yes. Daniel, have you gotten another job? I'm a, I'm a bit confused. I'm your boss. Why are you asking me out on a date for Valentine's Day? I mean... Daniel, the, the answer is no. It's not going to happen. By the way, I need you to go get fuel for the car. Why are you still here? So when I, when I was out, I saw this and I thought about you, so I bought it for you. No, I can't take this. Why? I don't... Daniel, you don't need to be buying me gifts. I know, but are I... you Are you tired of working here? Are you tired of working for me? No. Okay, why... then take your gift back and go get the fuel. Thank you. Thank you. Of all the men in the world, it's my driver. How bad can this get? I want someone richer than I am. Tall, handsome, knows how to make me laugh, easygoing, romantic, a perfect guy for a perfect Valentine. be the one though. Yeah, think about it. You completed the 30 days fasting and prayer that your prophet asked you to do and he's the only one that has shown interest. Uh -huh. <laughs> he can't be the one. Why? Can't you see the class difference? <laughs> Please. Listen, my love. Hmm? Class does not matter when the heart is involved. Mm. Mm. Well, this heart wants a mature, rich man. Keyword man, not boy. Not to mention my driver, please. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Why don't you check out this dating site? No. This dating site I've been no, talking to you about. No, no, no. <clears throat> Men, you are something else. Okay, so your username is Hot Chica. Check it out. Mm -hmm. What is your name for what? Well, I just created a profile for you on the dating site. No, <sighs> Judith, I said no dating sites. <sighs> Nobody's going to take me serious on there. It literally spells DESPERATE in capital letters. Are you not? I mean, all I'm saying, oh my gosh, you have an admirer already and he's so hot! No, no, yes. no give me that, delete it, it. Please, 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 no, no, no. send a message. No, delete it. No, don't delete it. He's literally so fine. Oh, he's hot. He's right? actually really handsome. Yeah, he's cute. 
Um, can you send me the login details? Let me have my phone first. I'll send it to you. Can I have my phone? Login details, kill you there. Log in, kill you there. Can you be serious? <laughs> no, Please. I won't. Oh my god. Maybe I should keep this. This is interesting. I am into real estate and interior design. <laughs> what do you do? You are your Over. own CEO. Trying to make you a smile, like rats. I like. See, bro, you get this girl who I meet for this dating app, man. I didn't know you were meeting new babes. I thought you and uh, what's her name were taking it seriously. Bro, have you seen the number of girls on this app? He oh, had to stick to one, my bro. You know it now. The person who I pity now do is when they believe you on top of this app when you did. So so lie. See, you better stop dreaming about that you're a proud boss. I'll start exploring other options. My bro. Thanks, but I'll pass. Plus, your mom was here earlier. What does she want? Why are you not taking our calls? That's not what I asked. It's fine. You should call her. She's worried about you, man. Come on, this girl, fine. <laughs> How I wish you all mine. I share my life with you. Together it's fine. I share my world with you. Tell me to smile That's when I realize That you are mine Everything is fine As long as you and I Just share This little you and me I wish, I wish I wish, I wish I wish, I wish Everything with you I wish, I wish I wish Joke. <laughs> this this guy on this dating app is so funny. <laughs> dating app. You know, I had no idea you were into that type of thing. Hey, don't judge me. Besides, this is my first time ever. Judith set up a profile for me and it's actually not so bad. Well, you need to be careful about online dating. Well, not everybody you meet online is good. What? I'm only looking out for you. <laughs> Look, I can take care of myself. I'm sure. This guy is really keeping you busy, you yeah? <laughs> I like talking to him. He's very interesting. Mm. I told you this good work. <laughs> I said it. <laughs> he just texted me his number. <clears throat> Sounds nice. Call him up. What? No. That will look desperate. <sighs> Chica, 
Can you for once just stop all these my limitations and call this dude up? To talk about what? Your first day? Hmm? I understand. <laughs> yeah, actually, lunch is fine, but uh, not this week at all. I have a very busy schedule this week. But here's what happen. I'll check my schedule for next week, and then I'll let you know if I'm free. Yeah. All right. Take care. Ciao. Don't tell me this guy just turned me down. Really? No, I don't think so. He'll come around. I mean, he's as thirsty as you are. So, do, do you really think so? I know so. Because, tell me, why on earth would he be on a dating site if he's not thirsty? He'll come around. I'm always right. In that case, I'm not going to hear from your mouth, though. Let me, let me check my shadow for next week. What shadow you get? <laughs> so, see, this chick is an entrepreneur. I don't feel let them know see I still the job on. You did job hunts because you rejected every single thing I sent your way. Bruh, menial jobs. Oh look me, I have a master's degree for Christ's sake. I know your master's degree too. But hey, I took the first job that came my way even if it was a driving one. What you need to do, you need to recalibrate your mind and take the small thing and work until the big thing comes your way. Nah, two different people, man. Hmm. I think the only difference between me and you is that you have a brother who sends you money every month. Thank God, because me, I can't complain. I'm sure. You know what, the pity? All those girls that you lie to the apostles. Bro, I didn't tell no lies. Mm. Yeah. What do you do? I'm telling them exactly what they want to hear. You know, women are moved by what they hear. Yeah, I beg, leave. Free me with your aspire to perspire speech. I beg. I beg. You know, let me can teach you. What? No, no, no. One. Dinner? Wednesday night at 7 p.m. Really? I told ya! <laughs> I told ya! He's as thirsty as you are! <laughs> nice! Nice! Let me try. Nice one! You look um, amazing. Thank you. You look quite dapper yourself. Thank you. Ah, love you. Okay. Good. I see. I see we still have gentlemen in Lagos. Well, a handsome man is always a gentleman. Mm. <laughs> so, what can I offer you? Um, I'll just have a glass of their housewives. Good point. <laughs> hey, waiter. And I believe <laughs> in every bell will go bell. In case you bear my bed, <laughs> I'll fucking kick that shit out the window. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm having a really good time. Yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. You know, I haven't been on a date in so long what how's that even possible considering how beautiful you are <laughs> i've been so busy with work and life no oh, what is work and life without a little romance it sounds boring to me i agree you know what i think i think we should do this again Lisa. i'll definitely love that nice so my place i'll cook You'll cook. Mm -hmm. Cooking is actually one of my hobbies. Okay, that's interesting. I definitely love to taste it. 
can assure you there's nothing close to what your dream boys have ever experienced. Oh. I'm about to cook up a storm. Really? Mm -hmm. He toots his own horn. Well, allow me to eat my own horn in peace. <laughs> <laughs> We really should do this again. Definitely. I like being around you. How'd you go? I owe you one. Okay. I owe you one for setting up a profile for me on that dating site. Wow. He's amazing. Like, he's literally so perfect. Oh my gosh. Really? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You know what? I hate to say I told you, I told you. <laughs> but yeah, I did. So, <clears throat> give me all the juicy, juicy details. I'm all ears. Okay. So, we talked and laughed and it felt like I've known him for years. Yeah. That's, that's how connected I felt to him. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Great. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> guess what? What? He asked me out on another date. Already? Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so, um, fingers crossed. Yes, fingers crossed. Man, why weep? People, this girl is drop dead gorgeous. Like, she's even prettier in real life than she is on her profile pictures. I like her already. Mm -hmm. What are you doing, talk? I thought you were serious with Mandy. Bro, Mandy is nothing compared to this girl. I'm telling yeah, you, gosh. this girl is fine. She is gorgeous and she's so sweet. Bro, I feel slept there already. Oh, come on, no, I'm not that bad. Maybe on the second date, eh? Mm -hmm. But not yet. What is this you're giving me about this baby? Let, let me see a picture now. What's going on? Relax, relax, calm down. You see her, she'll come to the house very soon. Which house? <laughs> you didn't use me, please. I'm not going to be You didn't use me, please. Okay. Where's the catch? You're going to have to cook for me. I don't understand the English. What is you're going to cook? Because I told her I'm going to cook. Uh -huh. If you told her I'm going to cook, why don't you cook? Come, come on now, you know I can't cook. But are you telling me to help you perpetrate a lie? Bruh. I'm not help asking you to help me cover up mother. That's just cook. Just help your guy. Oh, well, she just help my guy. Uh -huh. Hey, God. See him. If you think I'm going to cook for you for free, you're losing your mind. Better hold your money. Well, hold that one. Hold that one. She's calling. <laughs> hey. Hey, beautiful. Yeah. Come on now. Uh, I had a good time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mom? You finally picked my call. What do you want, mother? Oh, the last time I checked, you are still my son. Am I your son? Really? You ripped me up my privileges and now you're calling to tell me that I'm your son? Mother, listen, I've been doing very well without you this past I year. I didn't rip you off all your privileges. You have a roof over your head. Come over to the house tomorrow. I'll be waiting for you. Bye. You? <laughs> you look absolutely amazing. Thank you. <laughs> you look nice as well. Thank you. As always. Wow. Um, well, nice place. Thank you. You're welcome to our place of um, humble beginnings. What? Mm -hmm. Did you just say humble? Mm -hmm. You're calling all of this humble. Mm -hmm. this, this is loud. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> well, we try. What can I say? <laughs> By the way, 
Um, dinner is set, my lady. Mm. Mm. I hope it's as good as you brag. That's it. <laughs> Thank you. So here's the thing. Why don't you let your taste buds do the family now? <laughs> Deal, yeah? Deal. <laughs> This was actually really good. Mm -hmm. Well, wait until I cook you an intercontinental dish. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Just say the word and I'll do it. I like that. And I also like being around you. You make me feel comfortable. You are actually very safe around me. Well, I still have my pepper spray in my bag, just in case. Seriously? Just in case. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not a human eater. You are actually very safe around me. Plus, I have sisters and I wouldn't want anyone to ever take advantage of them. And, like you already know, I'm a perfect gentleman. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Mama. Uh, this is my housemate. Daniel, uh, this is. Um... No, no, no. What's going on? Mm -hmm. What's going on here? He's my driver. Should the person you're telling me about? Wait, does he live here? Why don't we um forget about him? Okay. And what have you been telling him about me? Well, for starters, I've been telling him a lot of good things about you. <laughs> How much I am. Um, like you and how I would like things to go a little bit further from here. <laughs> you know my friend literally twisted my hands until I joined that dating app. As a matter of fact, she actually set up a profile for me. Mm, it looks like I owe her thank you card. <laughs> and you were actually my first match on the app. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm happy I found you. I hope I'm not ruining the first impression thing. 
No. You're absolutely perfect. <laughs> Movie? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was fun. It was. Yup. <laughs> we should do it again. Definitely. Sometime really, really soon. Mm -hmm. I actually like having you around. Me too. I enjoy your company. Fine piece of art. <laughs> All right. So, it feels like I'm starting to miss you already. Right? <laughs> I'll see you soon, okay? Sure. <laughs> My keys. <sighs> As a gentleman. <laughs> I have no idea. The car isn't starting. I just serviced the car two days ago. You know what? Uh, I'll just get my keys inside. Oh, are you sure? Then I'll drop you off. Thank you so much. No, it's no problem. I'll call the mechanic and ask him to come pick it up. It's fine. Let me get the keys. All right. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Daniel, look, I, I don't know what's wrong with the car. It's not starting. So um, you have to come pick it up and take it to the mechanic tomorrow. All right. Gosh. Here we are. Yeah. Well, thank you for coming around and making my day. I really had fun. Me too. And now you know my house, so you're mm. welcome anytime. Sorry, sorry, I just uh, find you really irresistible. Sorry. Ju! <sighs> Judy! I'm here! Oh! <laughs> Okay, what's, what's the excitement all about? What? Let it out. He kissed me. <gasps> oh my gosh. He did? Okay, I am ready for all the juicy details. Okay. 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 Which one do you want to know first? The sweet one or the sour one? 
Wait, there's a sour one? Mm hmm Okay, let's hear that first. Mark and Daniel live together. W what now? Wait, Daniel, as in your driver. Girl, I was as shocked as you are right now. What? Mm -hmm. Well, then Daniel has some rich friends. I, I like him. Girl, enough about Daniel. Mark is the real deal. Okay. He's everything I want in a guy. He's rich. He's tall. <clears throat> he has poise. Yeah. And he adores me. And he also doesn't care that I know Daniel, so... Oh, girl, I am happy for you. Thank you. <laughs> my girl is the <laughs> Oh, my God. This is just the perfect, perfect Valentine's Day yeah. coming up. The valley is valid. It's valid. It's valid. It's valid. It's I'm happy for you. Thank you. And you're glowing. Really, bro? Guy, relax. You never showed me a picture of your boss. How exactly was I supposed to know that she's your boss? Okay. Now that you know what she looks like, you know what she means to me. You have to let her go. Why should I let her go? Because I like her. And she likes me too. Why do you even want her, man? You're just going to play with her. <laughs> Listen, Mark. I'm not playing. She's not one of the women that you play with. These flowers aren't as pretty as you are. I love you. Mark. <laughs> what exactly do you think you're doing with Mark? Are you out of your mind? How dare you storm in here to ask He's about my just personal life? i with you, Chica. <laughs> oh my God, Daniel. I can see how petty you are. Now, please. Stay out of our business. Do you realize I've known him way longer than you have? Do you? Get out. Daniel, do not make me repeat myself. Get out! Fine. I'll go. The hell? My driver. Poppy, bro. Come on, Daniel. How long are we going to continue like this, man? Chica made her choice. It shouldn't cause us to quarrel, bro. Daniel. Dan. You know Mark has a girlfriend, right? He's just toying with you and he will leave you when he's done. That's it. Stop the car. Chica, I right. said stop the car.
Get out. You're fired. What? You heard me. Get out. You're fired. Get out of my way! Get out of my house. What? You heard what I said. Get out of my house. Wait, 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 bro. All of this is just because of a woman. Hey, 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 listen. You can ruin her life for all I care. But you are not going to do it from under my roof. Man, we've come such a long way. We can't do it all of us. Let of a woman. her go. Okay? Let her go. Fine! If that's what you want, fine! <laughs> You're so funny. Oh my god. No, seriously. I think you should look into what Daniel is saying. Girl, Daniel likes me. So it's obviously he's just pained and jealous that Mark is the one getting me. I know him. Oh uh, yeah. So one day. Okay, so now that you fired him, how are you going to go? Because you clearly do not like to drive or manage. I'll manage until I find another driver. Okay, boo. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. You what? Someone's calling you. Hey, handsome. <laughs> what? What? Okay, um, just, just um, text me the address and I'll, I'll be there right now. Okay, bye. What, what's going on? What's going on, chica? You still haven't answered me. What are you doing in a hotel? Daniel and I had to fall out. Why? It was either you or him. You know that guy's sick in the head. I fired him already. And besides, does the house even belong to him? What? How on earth can he afford a house like that with the salary that I paid him? His father left him the house. Well then, good riddance. And to hell with him and his house. I knew it was bad timing. I'd invested all my money in the business and now I don't have cash on me. I, I, don't, even, I don't even know how much longer I can put up with this place. Fine. You you don't have to worry. You you can stay with me for the meantime. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Such a bundle of joy. I'm so glad I found you. You're welcome. Thank you. And there's actually a bedroom upstairs, just in case you forgot. <sighs> um, uh, uh, <clears throat> oh, um, I'm me upstairs. <clears throat> so he literally lives here now. Oh my God, Judith. I already told you, he's here until he can find a place. Mm. 
Na so Lagos marriage is the start, Sha. What's I'm supposed to mean? All I'm saying is, I mean, you should have let the young man stay in the hotel. I mean, before the young man gets too comfortable and begins to think that this is his house. You know, I'm going to pretend and like we never had this conversation. And did I say something wrong? Daniel. Daniel? Please listen to me. Mark is not who you think he is. <laughs> Are you saying this because you're jealous? No, 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 look. I've known Mark since we're in university, okay? Chica doesn't deserve him. And if you love her, you will have her know that she shouldn't be in a relationship with uh, him. Well, too late. Not when he's already in the house. He did what? Mm-hmm. I mean, you asked him to leave. Because he has other places to go. His family house is here in Lagos. Why didn't he go there? Well, he said he had nowhere else to go. Oh my god, that guy's just full of lies. So even if what you're saying is true, how do we go about it? You know what? How about you seduce him? What? I promise you, you'll fall for it. You think he loves her? The moment he gets down with her, he's gone. I promise. I'm not in the mood for this, please. I know exactly. I will make you feel better. No, I, I actually have a bad headache. I have a headache, seriously. Was the only one awake? Well, apparently you're not. How about you said this? I promise, promise you, you'll fall for it. Okay, so what is this thing? I could not wait till we got home. You have to tell me. Um, 
It's about Mark. What about him? Chica, I don't want you to take this the wrong way, okay? I... It's you. What is it? Just, just talk. Mark is not who you think he is. <sighs> oh my God. You too? Listen, Daniel told me that... Daniel said what? He met up with Daniel? Obviously, he's going to tell a million lies. It's not a lie. It's not a lie, Chica. Mac only wants your buddy. That's all. I mean, have you slept with him? Not like it's any of your business, but why? Exactly. That's why he's still hanging around. You know, he's just interested in your buddy and that... Okay, fine. Ask him about Mandy. Daniel That's said... That's enough. Enough of Daniel said this and Daniel said that. I am 35 years old. I finally found a man that adores me. Why can't you be happy for me? I seduced him and he fell for it. You what? I mean, it was all Daniel's. That's I it. <laughs> Get out. Chica. I said, get out. Now. Strong, I was talking to you and you were ignoring me. Do you really love me? Of course, I love you. Where is this coming from? Then tell me the truth about Mandy. Who's Mandy? I should be asking you that. Daniel mentioned her name to Judith. Daniel, you know Daniel is not happy about the both of us. He asked me to back off from you. Why would he lie about that kind of thing? Because he loves you. You know what? I think you should go be with him. And, and you? Listen, if leaving you to go be with Daniel will bring peace, and so be it. I 
I love you. I really, really love you. But if Diane is going to be popping up every... I miss you so much and I can't wait to lay in bed with you. I love you so much. Babe, babe, I can't explain. It's, it's not what you think. Just go. Babe, babe, listen, she doesn't mean anything. I don't want to hear anything you have to say. Just go. I'm telling you the truth. Daniel was right. I thought this was love. This is love, baby. This is love. Get out. I said, get out. And that is the end of my perfect love story. I gave up on the quest for a perfect Valentine and just went back to living my life. Yes, I'm 35, but I'm happy with myself, my life, and my achievements. And as for Daniel, I couldn't bring myself to face him, so I stayed away. 
until Thank you. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so, um, have you called Daniel? Mm. I've been struggling with it. Mm. Listen to me, Chica. You know that guy really likes you. You know that, right? All he was trying to do was protect you from Mark. I wrongfully sacked him. Mm. I don't think that guy's ever going to talk to me again. <laughs> well, there's no harm in trying. I think he would. You know where he lives. Who's there? Hold on, hold on, give me a second, I'm coming. Mom? Won't you let me in? What are you doing here? Well, since you... You refused coming, I had to come. Wow. You really maintain this place well. You haven't answered my question, mother. What are you doing in my house? I asked you to come, but you didn't come, so I had to come myself. And uh, come and have a seat, we need to talk. <clears throat> well, as much as I like that, my food is burning. I have to go to the kitchen. Cook. Hmm. I hope the food is enough for two. Hmm. Hmm. Son, this is very delicious. Who taught you how to cook? Well, mother, if you don't remember, you left me on the street without any money or a roof over my head, so I had to survive, didn't I? First, this mansion is not the street. And secondly, you were busy lavishing the company's fund on irrelevant things. I had to do something as soon as possible before the company becomes history and your father will turn in his grave if I let that happen. <sighs> I wanted you to go out there to make your own money so that you'll be able to know how to manage your company better. And look at that. You learned cooking skills. Impressive. And I thought by the time I come back here, you must have sold everything in the house, but you didn't. That's also impressive. <sighs> I learned you got a job. Well, Mom, it will interest you to know that I lost that job already. That's good. You can resume work tomorrow in your company. Listen, Mom, please, do not joke with me. No, it's not a joke. The company is yours. I just wanted you to be better, and you're already doing that, so you can come back to work. Really? Mm hmm Thank you, Mom. You're welcome. Really, thank you. Mm hmm You're welcome. Yeah. So, Would you like to remain here or you follow me back home? I mean, if it's okay, I'd like to continue living here. 
That's okay. I'm going to send the driver to bring your car back so you can be able to use it to work tomorrow first thing in the morning. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, mom. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. So, tell me, who taught you how to cook? <laughs> because the Daniel I know <laughs> will rather go and buy a bottle of water in Europe than boiling it. Well, like I told you, mom, you left me out on the streets with no money and I didn't have any to throw away or lavish around. So, yes, <laughs> That's how it happened. Yes. I'm glad it happened that way because <laughs> it has reshipped you and you are a better person now. <laughs> I'm proud of you, son. Thank you. Mm? Thank you. I'm proud of you. And I'm sure your dad in his grave will also be proud of you. Tara. So how much were you paid at your office? How much was your salary? Ah. Well, if you must know, I was I was being paid a hundred thousand now. A hundred thousand? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How were you able to cope? Because <laughs> <laughs> the Daniel I used to do was spend that in just a few hours. It's gone. So how could uh, you cope for one year? Uh, well, mm? You know. Wow. <laughs> That's really, really impressive. Yeah. Well, I'm glad I never made a mistake to send you out there. You have sure made me proud because you learned a lot. I guess. <laughs> mm, I'm proud of you, son. Chica, are you sure about this? I'm, I'm just going to apologize and... Um, good morning, ma. Good afternoon. How may I help you? Um, ma, my name is Chica and... I'm here to see Daniel. Who are you? I'm... I, I used to be his boss. He used to work for me. He has gone to work and he will not be back till evening. Would you come back then? Um, Ma, please, do you know where he works? Hey. Hey. What are you doing here? Um, I stopped by your house and your mom told me where your office was. Okay, um, listen, I was just about to step out for lunch, but, um, if you need me to run back to my office... Oh, I no, no, it's fine. I won't take much of your time. I, um... I just came to apologize for everything that Mr. happened. Chica, you don't need to apologize for living life on your own terms, okay? No. N not when I was oblivious to, to the one that truly cared. Mark? You were right about him. You tried to protect me from him, and I wish I had listened. Listen, I um I hold no grudges against you, so thank you. You're welcome. So, um I I'm going out to eat. I'd, would you want to tag along? I'd love to, if that's yeah, I'd love to. Yeah, that's the best one. Okay. Are you serious? I'm telling you, that's how I went from spending over a million naira a month to managing the hundred thousand you used to pay me. Managing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh my God. You know, I actually like your mom. She's not like all these other mothers because that's exactly what you needed. You know the worst part about the entire thing? I had to learn how to cook. You? You can cook too? Of course. I mean, who do you think made the food that you and Mark ate? What? Mark cannot cook. 
No, no, but no buts. He, he begged me and I made the food. Also, <laughs> absolutely no reason to dwell on it because that does us no good. Right. <laughs> Hey. hey, it smells good. It looks great. Hey. Thanks, baby. Hey, mom. Hi. Hi, son. Good afternoon. Ma. Good afternoon. How are you, pretty? I'm fine, thank you, ma. Uh, good to see you. Good to see you. Mom, listen. I don't know if I've done the introductions before. Have I? Well, I've met her before, but official introduction, no. Okay, then. So, since she has just recently agreed to officially be my girlfriend wow. mom officially meets my girlfriend sounds interesting so i found a daughter-in-law in you right uh, uh, mommy oh yeah baby steps now <laughs> 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 oh you came at the right time mm. i just finished preparing lunch i will i hope you like to have some Yes, ma. Actually, I'm very, very hungry. Good. Do? So come and have a seat at the dining while I come and serve oh, you. Oh no, ma! Please, no. Let me, let me, let me help you. Huh? I'll help you out. So you want to assume your duty as a daughter-in-law? Does, does nobody want my help? <laughs> hey, I'll I help you out. Have a seat Guys. there. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't agree with you. For real? Okay, okay. If you say so. You are fine, you win. <laughs> I win, of course I win. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Why do you have my picture in your bedroom? Well... You know that I love all your pictures. And I just wanted to keep one for myself. Hmm. Mm -hmm. You love the pictures or you love me? Both. So, where are you taking me for Valentine's Day? Well, that depends. Where does Her Royal Highness want to go to? Hmm. I haven't thought about it yet. You know what? How about we go on a picnic? Just both of us. Sounds good. I promise you, you'd love it. <laughs> Tell me a story. What kind of story? The one where there's a happy ending. Oh, you mean like the type where the woman that I love finally decides to be with me after she fires me? Oh my god. Very bad joke. That was a great joke. Why are you using my joke? That was in my mouth. Okay. Sorry. I got you something. What? Find out. Why? Where did you get me? <laughs> Sit up. Come here. Oh my god. Yep. Mm -hmm. This is what I'm Okay. Hold on. It's a spark. So I can get it. Yeah. Yes, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I'm having a bit of trouble untangling this. Okay. Got it? Good. I got it. Here we go. Ooh. I think I'm great at picking on gifts, don't you? Oh, I love it. Thank you. 
<laughs> I have a question. Shoot. Mm-hmm. Shoot. Okay, um, you know, I've been thinking about this for quite a while, so I want to ask. Mm-hmm. Would you mind marrying me? What? Would you mind? <laughs> Is this supposed to be a couple of that? Okay. I know you. Where's your ring? I, I, I mean, those cool. I am sorry <laughs> for the things I have done. I had cries and lonely all night long. Confusion, obsession is all I ever feel. Can't even believe in me. It's a crazy. 